Hi everybody, my name is Josephine. I'm here at TV Ray Studio in Finland. I want to give a shout out to every musician that has been part of the project. Many voices, one cry, heal the land. And I also want to thank uh, Living Studios in Bamenda that has been really part of this project. I'm here to talk to you about this project. It's a song that uh, the Lord gave me about uh, eight years ago. I started recording the project but never finished it. And uh, after like eight years, I went back to the studio. I said, do you still have that song that I started recording in your studio? And uh, Dr. Bla uh, Walter Blackson said, yes, you are very, very, very lucky because I have deleted every song from my, from, 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 from my system. It is only that one that is left. I said, well, then I'm ready to finish the song. Uh, to cut it short, I was able to finish the song recorded in, 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 in the United States of America. But still, God would not allow me to release the song. I kept saying every time, I'll go on Facebook, I said, coming soon, single release. But the Lord would not allow me to release that song. And then sometimes this year, you know, I had the urge, you know, because it's been a long time I've not really been singing uh, because I'm, I'm a gospel artist. I said, I think I want to start singing. But the thing that the Lord put in my heart first thing was to do, reminded me of that song, uh, Heal the Land. And I called Living Studios in Bamenda. I said, oh bro, you know what? I have this project in my mind that God is asking me to do. He's asking me to get musicians, gospel artists from different parts of the world to be part of this project. I don't know if you can do it, but what I have seen you producing in your studio and from some of the testimonies that is coming from your studio, I believe that you can do this project. And uh, Dobby said, no problem sis, I can do it. So I said, go ahead, let's do it, let's work it out. So we started working on the project and uh, before I realized uh, many people became, you know, interested in the project you know, artists from the United States of America, artists from Europe, even from Asia, you know, uh, uh, many people just wanted to be part of the project because we said in such a time like this, it is a time when God is using his children to bring love, to bring healing, to bring restoration back into our lives, our family, our community and to different parts of the world. So I want to take this opportunity to thank Living Studios in Bamenda that has, you know, done a great job. Dobby, you are a great guy. I want to thank you because you put your soul into this project, you know, to see that it comes to the realization. And I want you to understand that it's not a project, it is a movement. Because this project, through this movement, will be able to help the needy people, those who are in need, you know, those who need help, not only in Africa, but also in Asia and in different parts of the world. So I want to encourage you to be part of the project. Through this project, we want to be able to carry out charitable deeds in different parts of the world. The Bible says in 2 Chronicles 7, 14, that if my people who were called by my name will humble themselves, pray, seek my face and turn from their evil ways, I will hear from heaven and forgive their sin and heal their land. As musicians, as gospel artists, we have come together with that cry. Many voices, one cry, heal the land. To seek the face of the Lord, to bring healing, restoration, peace to our lives, our community, our family, and to different parts of the world. Be a part of it. Thank you very much. God bless you.